Right, hello everyone and welcome back to another video on the channel now today. We are going to be discussing five players we both would like to see at Wrexham FC. I've picked five and my dad's picked five. Got the Wrexham shirt on today, so how many likes should we smash? 25. 25 likes, we can smash that. Um, and yeah, fifth place for me. It's in no particular order. I've gone for Sam Osborne. Now, he's an attacking midfielder who plays for National League side, National League North side, Leamington. He recently played quite well against us in the FA Trophy. Um, he scored nine goals in 14 games, which is very good for an attacking midfielder and won November's National League North Player of the Month. I think he'd be a perfect fit in the midfield and would add a bit of like more attackingness in it. Who's your fifth place? Place. Yeah, I've gone for an attacking midfielder. We all know him because he's played for us in the past. Oh, who is it? Uh, it's John Rooney. Oh, I love uh, to see him. Very back creative at player. Always gets goals. He's got a bit of magic about yeah. him. I'd love to see him back at the club. So oh, yeah, my fifth yeah. place. In no order though, John Rooney. Yeah. Let him go too easily. Yeah. Fourth place, I have gone for Jack Muldoon. He's an experienced striker who currently plays in the football league for Harrogate Town. He's got nine goals four assists in 19 games. He got promoted with Lincoln City in 2015 under the Cowley brothers, so he clearly knows how to get out of this division, and I think he would do a good job, score goals, and hopefully push for playoffs if we got him this January and get us up to the Football League. Fourth place. Uh, fourth place, I've gone for another striker and another ex-player. Um, tall striker, very powerful, yeah. very direct. Ooh, um, we should have signed him when we had the chance to on a permanent contract. It's Barrows Scott Quigley. Oh, how did I forget uh, him? I love this player, I love his yeah. style. Um, why we didn't sign him when we had the chance, I don't know, it's obviously yeah. down to money, but missed money. opportunity. Yeah. So my fourth place is Scott Quigley. <sighs> what a striker he is, and I think he'd be willing to come back <clears throat> down to the football league because yeah, of the size yeah. of Wrexham. Um, and we could easily yeah. get him with the Maybe. money we have. Yeah, you never hopefully. Know. You never know. Third place, I have gone for Courtney Duffus. He's a 25-year-old striker who's currently playing for National League strugglers Yeovil Town. He's got a decent scoring record for Yeovil and Irish side Waterford. So I bet you're thinking, why have I picked him? Purely because I think he's played something like 60 games for Yeovil and got 30 goals. So he knows where the back of the net is. And I think Wrexham, at the minute, we need a goal scorer. And I think Courtney Duffus, he's not too old, but he's got a bit of experience in this league. Um, and like Muldoon, he would score goals. So Courtney Duffus, third place. Yeah, my third one is another striker. Ooh, okay. We, we need strikers, yeah. Uh, he's a 32-year-old <laughs> experienced striker. He's been around a lot. Got a very very good goal scoring record. He's currently in our he's currently in our division. Uh, whether we could afford his wages is another matter. Um, Adam Rooney. Oh my so it's God, the sec yeah. second Rooney on my yeah. on my list. He's left. He, well, he, remember he left <clears throat> to Salford from yeah. Aberdeen. Yeah. There can only be one 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 reason for that money. Yeah, wasn't it? His record. You, you really wouldn't good. go from Aberdeen to Salford City in the national uh, league. His experience, you know, yeah, the knows where the net is. He'd be a good signing for us. Second place, it's got to be a striker. His name is Giovanni Brown. So this is a striker who's currently out of favour at Colchester United. Mm -hmm. Hence, why he's on loan at Forest Green at the minute. He's played five, scored none. Um, he scored 19 goals in 19 games for St Neots Town a couple of years back before being snatched up by Cambridge United and then do really well there and going on to Colchester where I think he's got like a goal every 3.5 games or something. So he's a good striker and I think he'd be one willing to come down to the National League. So second place, Giovanni Brown. Wow, you really have done your research. <laughs> yeah. Uh, my... Second to last choice, I hope I pronounce his name correctly, oh, no. is a 28-year-old 20, winger. He's six yep. foot one. Mm. He's very, very good. Um, creates lots of chances for his team, and I think he would fit in to our team perfectly. Mm, um, he plays for Notts County, and his name is Enzio... Oh, Bold, Boldwine. Boldwine, yes. Dutch. Yeah. Um, he very, just looks yeah. very direct and very... Powerful whips mm. and crosses in, uh, yeah. which is what we need. Um, yeah. So yeah, very good player. Enzo Boldvine, Boldvine, yeah, Boldvine, He's yeah. Dutch as well. Dutch. Yeah. First place, Ooh. I have gone for. Obviously, it's no <clears> order. <throat> I've gone for Brad Walker, a former Rex midfielder who left us 
to go and play for Sam Ricketts at Shrewsbury Town. Obviously, he was in the heart of the midfield under Ricketts at Wrexham and then left with Ricketts. thing is that we know what he's about and we know he can ping a very good pass and he can sometimes chip in with a goal. Um, he would be perfect alongside Harris and Luke Young in the midfield. Love to see him back at Wrexham. So, Brad Walker, first place. OK, my first place. I've gone for yet another striker. Yeah. Uh, currently a free agent. Ooh. Um, He's, he's, he's another experienced striker, ex-Welsh international, with a very good proven goal-scoring record. Bit of a controversial choice, maybe, due mm. to things that have happened in his personal life. Uh, and he's Welsh, local boy, Ched Evans. Oh, my God, yeah. What a striker. Uh, I think, yeah. yeah. He's been up the levels Evans, as well. Yeah, he's been he like has... Sheffield United, Fleetwood. Yeah, no one's like than that is. Ex-Welsh Welsh international, <clears throat> so he knows how the back in the net is. Yeah. Um, we haven't agreed on any. Nope. That's interesting. So, yeah, That's that is the video. We picked five players we'd like to see in the Wrexham shirt and sign this January. So I think I could have picked another ten. Easily, easily. yeah. We could have done so many ten players, players we'd like to see. I did have a couple of yours, Muldoon, Dan, yeah. and Osborne. So if you enjoyed this video, <clears> make sure to smash 25 likes. Two Wrexham games have just been postponed, so a bit disappointing with that. More time to train, more time to get new players in less games for Keats to drop points and get sacked. <laughs> so yeah, thank you guys for watching and we'll see you guys